it smelled like mothballs and the flooring was was terrible You will notice that my bed is not fixed. That is because I'm washing our sheets and everything, our comforter. It's complicated. Our house had an entire like addition added on at some point. I, It was an apartment for the previous owner's mom. Um, so it had like a small kitchen, uh, washer and dryer in here. This was the living room and our closet was her bedroom. And of course a bathroom with like wider a wider door and like handrails and stuff because she was older it smelled like mothballs and the flooring was was terrible i am going to clean this place up and organize things because it's starting to look like it needs it needs some help um and then I will also show you some pictures of what it looked like or videos of what it looked like when we bought the house and also what it looks like now. So it looks way different. Absolutely recommend these little suspender type things to keep your sheets from popping out, your fitted sheet from popping up. I'm nice and um, six, and I like it, and I sort of like it. You're and talking. I'm Josh. Hey, okay, so uh, halfway through, everything's pretty much clean, um, except for the floors need to be swept and mopped, and the closet needs to be tackled yet. The closet is what I'm dreading the most, but it will be the most satisfying too, because it's the worst. It's not so much dirty, it's stuff everywhere, because that's where it goes when we don't know where to put it. <laughs> And there's a bunch of clothes that we don't wear that need to go into a storage bin and wait for a yard sale or they need to go to Goodwill or they need to be donated somewhere or something needs to happen. Anyway, but first water. I am so thirsty. Oh, it's bad.
The master bedroom, the jacuzzi room, the closet, and the bathroom are all 
deep cleaned and organized. So 